not all solar panels are created equal. By the wrong type of solar panels, you could end up wasting your money or losing efficiency. Well, let's talk about what you need to know before you buy your solar panels. This is the solar panel, this is the sun. Now in your typical 100 watt solar panel, there are 36 cells. Each cell produces about 0 0.5 volts. So in your typical 12 volt, 100 watt solar panel, the VOC voltage open circuit is 18 volts. There are some common solar panel configurations describing the wattage, voltage, and how many cells there are in each panel. So to avoid buying a fake solar panel online, check how many cells there are on the panel, check the voltage open circuit, if it's below 18 volts for a typical 12 volt solar panel, there's no, no such thing as a 12 volt solar panel by the way, but you, you get my point. The size of a 100 watt panel right there. There are four main types of solar panels, starting with the monocrystalline. Mono, these are the fancy ones that you see. It has a sleek black look to it. They are made from a single crystal structure, making them the most efficient solar panel types, typically around 20 to 25% efficient. They work really well in low light conditions, however, they come at a higher cost. And then you got your polycrystalline solar panels. They are like the budget friendly <laughs> cousin of your monocrystalline. They are made from multiple silicon crystals. They are cheaper, but they're less efficient. Usually about 15 to 20 percent efficiency. Then you got your flexible solar panels. They are the lightweight ones. Pretty bendy, easy to install, great for portable setups like RVs and camper vans. And they work pretty well in shaded areas, but they're even less efficient, usually about 10 to 15 percent efficient. Then you got your bifacial solar panels. Now they absorb sunlight from both sides. Meaning they can generate more power per panel compared to the traditional ones. They are great for ground mounted setups or other areas with reflective surfaces like snow or even sand. With the right configuration, you could get the efficiency as high as 30% greater than your mono crystalline. So, which solar panel type is the best? Well, it depends on what you need, your budget, how you're going to mount them, and how it fits into your system. If there are any questions, feel free to leave a comment down below. If you found it to be interesting, please like the video, 
it will really help me with the YouTube algorithm. Made some more drawings of a nice little cabin and a camper van for you to enjoy. Until next time.